Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I kind of did the same video yesterday, but somebody's asked me a question how you could do different colors on, on the same object, and we kind of did that yesterday, but I just, and then I thought, I'm not going to make a video, I just wrote the answer back, but then I thought, you know, there is one little secret here that you could do, uh, not, a, not a secret, a little inside what you could do. Uh, Let's see how big our star is and it's 12 inches. We're gonna take our nudge factor and make it 15 inches. And we're gonna control D and make a duplicate and move it over. Then we're gonna take our two point line and we're gonna go from that node to that node. From that node to that node. To that node to that node. Whoop, I missed it. See, it actually said edge. It needs to say node. And then from that node to that node, and one one more. From that node to that node. Now in that other one, I took, took the um, virtual segment delete key and deleted this long line. That gave me the five parts of the star. And then you can use your smart fill tool with any color you want. We're gonna mix them up. We're gonna go yellow, purple, blue, light blue, and green. And I kind of explained that to him on the trying to reply, but then you need to take away, so the easiest thing to do, because I don't know, he's evidently a printer, and the, the hair lines that I use might be visible, so just select everything and right click no line. Well, that also took away our outline for the star if you wanted an outline. So there's two ways you can do it. This way is just nudge it back. Well, let's change it to black. If you wanted a black line, let's make it three points so you can see it. And let's make it black. And now let's nudge it over. Now you've got an outline, but you don't have any center lines. There's no center line, it's just colors. Now, if you'd forgotten to do that, it's easy enough because these are four different pieces. You can select them all and go right here to boundary and it put a boundary around the star. Exactly the same. We're gonna make it black and three points. So you get the same result. But that way, if you're a printer um, and you don't have to have the line and um, I'm still working on this for somebody and I might make a video. It's a little, little in depth, but you might enjoy it. Hope that helped a little bit and thank you for watching.